Hi there, I'm Lee, welcome to iMineBlocks. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you my burst coin earnings for the month of June. So currently got 115 terabytes on the network and I'll be showing you, you know, the earnings that they produce um, over the previous month. So let's hop over to the office and I'll show you the current setup and then I'll break down the actual earnings. Okay guys, so you can see the current setup behind me. A bit of a funny angle today because I'm just uh, on my phone. Um, so we're currently at about 115 terabytes. This is the current Burst Coin setup. You can see on the right hand side two new additions. They are Seagate 8 terabyte uh, backup plus drives. So they're the new additions for this month. This is a capture of all the transactions that I received from the pool during the month of June. And I've just highlighted those just so you can see them on an individual basis. And the total balance, my Burst Coin earnings for June is 26,802 burst. Okay, so this is the actual exported transactions for the actual burst blocks that I found. Um, you can see from the export that I found 18 burst coin blocks. Now the rewards for these blocks should have been 31,556, um, but because I was pool mining, some of those rewards got shared to other members of the pool, um, and I ended up coming out a little bit short on that basis. So. I'll save that topic for another day, but I just wanted to share this part with you. Okay, so on the burstcoin.biz calculator, you can see that Burstcoin is currently trading at 580 Satoshis today. It's currently the 6th of July. So 580 Satoshis times 26,802 Burstcoin gives us a grand total in dollar amount of 391.90 or 0.155 Bitcoin. Okay, so you may have noticed that I earned less burst coin this month than I did over the previous month. The primary reason for that is the network difficulty. More and more miners joined the network during the actual month of June and the actual difficulty went up over three times. Um, coming into June, it was at 30,000 uh, terabytes and now we're up over 80,000. So much, much harder, more miners and that means everyone gets proportionately less. Okay, and just a real quick look at the Burst Coin chart for the price over the last three months. So you can see during the actual month of June, the price was actually quite stable, trading roughly around one and a half cents per burst, uh, mostly throughout the majority of June. The only exception is around 24th, it went to two and a half cents, but then come back down around to that one and a half cent level. So the prices are fairly stable over the last month. So that's it for this video. I sincerely hope you've enjoyed watching. Um, I did try and make this one a more condensed uh, version. If you have any questions or comments, please put them in the comments area below and I'll be sure to get back to you guys. Um, if you haven't already subscribed, please consider doing so. Um, I put out videos like this on a regular basis and it'd be great to have you part of our community here. So thanks for watching guys. I'll see you on the next video.